I'm currently working on this 1980s Grundig T20 Hi-Fi tuner. It's an FM only model. It does not receive AM, which is kind of interesting. It did need some work. It needed a good cleaning. It needed several solder joints redone, especially of those uh, two three terminal voltage regulators. Those were about ready to fall out. It was that bad. And it had quite a few red plastic can Röderstein capacitors in it. And those are of course always suspicious. And since there were so many of them, I was able to come to a few conclusions regarding the problems that these capacitors tend to have. And I wanted to share those with you. Now, first of all, there are actually a few Röderstein capacitors still left in the unit. There is one there, and there is another one right there. Now, that is because those were actually quite good, and the replacements that I had weren't any better. So I decided to leave those in the unit. These are the ones that I replaced. And it seems like what makes them fail primarily is heat. Now, there were two of these Röderstein capacitors. There was one right there in between these uh, voltage regulators. And it was getting really hot in there. And then there was another one right there. And it turns out this one, the capacitor that used to sit right there, was actually the worst one. And the second worst one was sitting right here. So I definitely say that uh, heat is a problem for these capacitors. Now these are the two bad capacitors. And you can kind of see how the red plastic can is cracked. Now, on this one, it's really bad. On this one, it's, uh, it's just starting to uh, occur. You can see a few cracks in there. Now, the worst one had an ESR of a whopping 140 ohms. The second worst one, I think, was like 39 ohms. So, definitely bad. The other capacitors that did not get hot, the ESR was not excessively high. The interesting thing is that the capacitance really starts drifting. All of these capacitors, now with capacitors, the capacity has a fairly wide tolerance range for an electrolytic capacitor. It is the nominal value minus 50% or plus 100%. However, some of these capacitors, the capacity was actually out of tolerance, meaning it was more than twice of what it should be. And that was the thing with all of these capacitors, including the ones that I decided to leave in the tuner. The capacity goes up. And... Also on these, with a really bad ESR, the capacity had gone up a fair bit. So it seems like if you have something that has to have exactly the right capacity, uh, these can cause problems even if the ESR is fine. The capacitors with OK ESR but excessively high capacity were sitting in this area of the tuner where there is no source of heat. So this problem does not seem to be caused by heat. And that's it already for this video. Just a few words on these red plastic can Röderstein capacitors. Thanks for watching. Deutschlandfunk. Informationen am Abend.